Brie, it's wonderful to meet you. Nice to meet How you, too. Uh, congratulations on Kong Skull Island. Um, I was wondering, uh, whenever you saw the film for the first time, was there a sense of relief that you've just been looking in the right place the entire oh, time? Oh, completely, yeah. Yeah, I think we were all kind of relieved by that. Especially when, it's easier when it's just you, because you can kind of look wherever you want, but when you've got like six of you, it's pretty important that you're all looking in the right direction. Now, Jordan mentioned uh, that his plan was to get everybody into the jungle and for you all just to collectively uh, lose your minds. Uh, so what was that experience like? And did anyone actually lose their mind? Or? I think he's probably the only one that actually lost his <laughs> okay. mind. Uh, maybe so. <laughs> right, of course. Uh, I think that there was something quite brilliant about the fact that there was no cell service a lot of the time. So this thing that we're so tapped into and connected to kind of just went away and we were all forced to be together and hang out. We were also so deep in the jungle that there was no trailer for us to go back to because it was too far away. So we just had this tent and like 10 chairs and we would just kind of hang out and like try to not get completely eaten by bugs. Forced to talk to each other. Yeah, yeah but it's great, yeah. you know? And I know that whenever you were filming this, you were back and forth because you were winning so many awards yeah, no. for Room. But that was your work with uh, Lenny Abramson, yeah. um, who we're all very proud of back in Ireland. Oh, but good. I was wondering, um, are you any more plans to maybe work together again? Because it's a surefire Oscar, obviously, every time <laughs> oh, you no. work together. Uh, I hope so, because he's like one of my favorite filmmakers and favorite people. And it was just an absolute dream collaborating with him. So I hope so. For all of those words that you do pick up, um, and hopefully pick up more as well, um, do you collect them all in one particular area, like an awards dungeon, or just stick them all at the bottom <laughs> of the bed? Or Well, when I first started collecting them, because they're all such different shapes, I thought, maybe there's something to this. Maybe they all, at one point, all fit together. You know, maybe there's some secret cave that I need to go to, and if you place all of them there, then, like, a big door opens, and I get to go to a magical land that no one's ever seen before. So I'll let you know if that happens. That's, uh, I think that's an excellent plan for it. Yeah, yeah it's, it's going to be the new Indiana Jones movie. Brilliant. I've watched that. <laughs> Better than the last one, anyway. And uh, I was wondering, you've got another excellent film coming out, Free Fire, mm -hmm. um, and working with Jack Rayner, Killian Murphy, a couple more uh, Irish guys. What was that like, uh, Working with those and guys Smiley inside. too, is it? Smiley? And Michael Smiley, of yeah. course, Sheikers. Yeah, yeah sorry, Michael. It's okay. Mm -hmm. We had we had little pins made that were Team Irish. Oh, actually. Yeah, on set because um, Laurie Rose, the the DP, he always makes each week he makes um, a badge that kind of has some sort of quote or something to do with what happened the week before. So we had ones that said Team Irish. Do you still have it as well? Put it in your. I do. No, I have it on one of my jackets back at home. Excellent. You can keep it in your awards. I love my Team well. Irish shirt. What should we do with people who use? their phones in the cinema. Oh, don't use your phone in the cinema. I don't know how I feel about that because part of it makes me think maybe maybe we, maybe the movie's not, it makes me insecure about my movies if you're on your <laughs> phone because <laughs> it should be that, it should be engaging, yeah. right? I mean, I think it's a real test because that shows how, how addicted we are to that constant stream of media. So maybe it's a good meditation to kind of just put it away. And uh, what can you not tell us about your Marvel projects? Oh, I can't tell you anything. Okay, wonderful. Cheers. But thanks yeah, for thanks for that question. Yeah, no, cheers. <laughs> Great. It's been a pleasure. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. Yeah.